great Louis Armstrong song, The Wonderful World. He's talking about some baby just born, and he says that in the early time of the song, he'll, uh, he'll learn much more than I ever know. And that's, that's, of course, true as we continue to chart knowledge. But I'm just talking about life experiences. Um, if somebody 40 years old is going to have many more life experiences and thus much more wisdom than somebody 15. And yet, we're letting the 15-year-old tell us what's going to happen and how we have to behave. And I just, I can't relate to it. If I had tried that with my parents, I... <laughs> I it, it would not... It would not have flown. It would not have... Like I've mentioned to my father, who was brilliant and could express his intelligence. I mean, there was no doubt that he was. There was just no way he was going to let some 15-year-old high school punk tell him something about life. Uh, it, it, it might be quite hearing it and misunderstand, but uh, he was not going to actually consider that the 15-year-old might know more than he did. And but this is not an arrogance thing, and it's not. It's, a, it's, a, it's about raising kids properly and imparting your knowledge to them and your wisdom in ways that help them and all that. And uh, the whole concept of tough love, there's a place for it, even with child rearing, and that's what I think has vanished a lot. So we have Nan here from the village. The village is saying, if, if, if my kids try to tell me that I can't see my grandkids, fine. They're out of the will. I don't care. They're out of the will. I'm not going to sit there and just cower in fear over, over what, particularly about my political, particularly when I know more than they do about what's good for this country. They can't possibly know what's good for this country if they're supporting Democrats. They can't possibly know it. That's the way I look at it. If my kid were, were aiming or leaning left, I'd be so scared, and I would take like, you can't possibly know what's best for this country if that's what you think. I tell them that flat out. No, you would think you would rush, but when you have your own kids, you wouldn't talk to them. And I have to say, okay, maybe, I don't know. Since I don't have that emotional bond, it's hard for me to actually claim what I was doing. My, I'm honestly telling you that that's what I would if I'm minding my own business one day and have a kid, the kid comes home, I think I'm really going to vote for Biden. Why? Because I hate Trump. I don't like Trump's tweeting. I, like, I would ask myself.